My dear brothers and sisters, in Jesus Christ, peace of our Lord be with us all. We all love our parents very close. We love our dad or our father with all kind of expression of our love. We admire the sacrifices that he put up to bring each family and all the struggles, the stress and strain that he undergoes to bring up all each and every one of us that admires his space in our family. Both my parents, mother and father, took all kind of pain for their children. And once, if the children, they fall sick, how much they take the pain to bring them up. In the same way, Today we are discussing about the great love of the Father for each one of us, his children, we Christians, we human beings. Father loves all human beings as he has created each one of us in his image and likeness. Today we are discussing about the Gospel of St. John chapter 10 verses 11 to 18 where we see who is a good shepherd? Who is a father? We see the good shepherd who lays his life for his sheep. We have two images of the shepherd. One who, he, who owns the sheep and the other one who hired the sheep to just to look after. Both differs the intimacy of love and the ownership to the sheep. The one who hired the sheep will run away when there is difficulties. When the, threat, when the life of the shepherd is threatened, he runs away leaving the sheep abandoned. But the good shepherd who really owns the sheep, he would be ready to sacrifice to safeguard his own sheep. Our father our master Jesus, who is a good shepherd, he owns our lives and he is ready to sacrifice his life for we human. That we have experienced in the Holy Week or when we have commemorated the sacrifice of Jesus on the cross for saving his, his saving the life of his sheep that each one of us. The, the classical image of the master, a shepherd carrying a lamb on his hand, he symbolizes how God loves each one of us. Let us keep our trust, who really ready to sacrifice his life for us, that's our Jesus, and look forward our daily life. Whenever we fall in our life, whether it is of the diseases, as we all are threatened, by the great pandemic has uh, is existing in this world right now where we have a master he would bring peace and he would he would save our life wherever, even if we struggle in this life let us keep our trust in the good shepherd who cares for our life may god bless each one of us